In this tutorial, we're going to look at the click button trigger. This is one of the most powerful triggers that we have launched to date. Go into the engine area and in the triggers hit view all. To set up the email button click trigger, you will have to go into the edit option and you will have to activate this. The DNA plan that we preload into your account is called trig email button click. So let's have a quick look at this. We'll hit edit at the bottom to save this. We will then go into engine, into the DNA plans, and we will type trig, and we will locate the email button click DNA and hit edit. Quite simply, in this DNA plan, all we are doing is setting a phone call to let you know that someone clicked a button in your email. You can advance this DNA plan by having SMSs, emails, letters, conditions, and make it as complex as you want. But for the basis of showing you how this works, the action is we're going to have a really important button on our email that if anyone clicks, we want our agents to call them straight away. So if we now go into the engine and into the templates database, we can look at any email, add a button to it, and then apply this certain trigger. If we use the blank email as a test, I'm going to drag the buttons widget across and we can see here now that we can relabel it. So if we label this to something that's really important like thinking of selling your home, click here and then we will make it apply that trigger. So let's update the label by clicking into the button area and updating the button text. Now that we have the text updated, we want to send them to a specific URL that may be on your website that relates to the button. So I've put this as lockedon.com forward slash selling, which will take them to a nice page about selling your home. At the bottom of this, we can see select trigger, and this will show us a list of all of the available triggers that are active. We now can apply the email button click. One final thing you may want to do is in the colors, set the row background color as white. It will default to white when you go to send the email, but it looks nice in your email template builder if you have it white as well. So now we have finished setting up the email with the trigger on the button. Once you have finished editing the template, you'll need to hit the save widget option and then save and close. Final thing left to do is now test the email to yourself, click the button and see the task apply to your client record set for the agent to give you a call.